Big, big trouble. trouble. Right. Big trouble podcast, and we perfectly trying to get into some trouble. It's your host, controversial season. I'm Ken Wynn. Kev all the show, man. You yeah. bet. Episode 38. 38. Y'all see Kev back. He was on suspension. Hey, my seat a little warm, too. Nigga, <laughs> man, sitting in the seat, bro. Yeah, put him on suspension. Nigga ain't miss a day. I think I already played. <laughs> I got a scar right here. <laughs> so it's a good one. This is uh, this 38 special. 38, man. Yeah. Come on, man. Hey, y'all. I don't give a damn about this. <laughs> Not really. Niggas just sub me out right now. <laughs> hey, like, comment, subscribe, man. For real. Yeah. Hey, but, you know, this one here is cool. This is like that, bro. I know what, because y'all really don't know what day it is, and we don't tell you. Yeah. It's special. Yeah. That's why it's the 38 special, because we, yeah. we're doing other things today, man. We're doing yeah. the wrong of We're doing communion. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so we ain't taking no shot. We ain't taking no We just starting out clean, right? Let me start off by saying, bro, that my beat ain't just passed. Okay. I'm 35. Damn, you just age dropped like that? I'm just saying, bro. I'm, I'm, Damn, you are, bro. I know, bro. I don't want to talk about that, bro. Like, it's a blessing. It's a blessing to um to make it to this age, bro. Because, you know, every week, every month, I'm study seeing boys dropping out. Yeah. Here and there over different shit, bro. So, it's a blessing to see 35, man. Right. But my B-Day came right before the fight. Mm-hmm. You wouldn't I, I missed the fight, bro. I missed the fight. But you ain't missed the fight. No, I ain't missed the fight, but I mean, really? I missed the fight recap. I missed the recap, so you I was in the last video. Just footage show something else. Episode 37. He was in the episode 37, so don't worry about I'm that. Driving it right <laughs> <laughs> but the reason why I'm saying it is because, bro, I'm steady going back looking at this fight, bro. Yeah. I, I can't get over it, bro. It's, 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 it's just it's, shocking to me, bro. Me and too. I and I was on the right side of the equation, bro. Right, me too. This fight was so bad that I think that I can whoop Errol Spence, bro. At this point in my life, <laughs> y'all niggas keep stop playing Errol. Man. Beat the dog shit out of y'all, bro. <laughs> nah, I ain't gonna lie. We might fight a tie if anything. <laughs> nah, <laughs> nah, he ain't gonna <laughs> like that. I ain't gonna let a nigga. You talking like a street fight? I'm talking about the gloves. Nah, kid. Man, kid. Did you see this, bro? Bro, this championship box, you gonna dumb that man down to us? We just got to remember where he is. Look at the niggas, you can fight now. Yes, I did. I had to go back and rap. I had been <laughs> saying that. Nigga looking at Danny like, so you think you can whoop Sean Porter? I think so. <laughs> no. He had cleaned that no, down. No, 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 no. But man, I'm just saying, that performance, bro, just made me think like, Bro, you know, I just don't think boxing is hey, what it used to be, bro. Oh, you taking it down there because your man's in So you ain't man down? You not going to even uh, wait until uh, next fight and give him the benefit of the doubt? I mean, the next fight, bro, I probably can see it probably. I give it the angle you come. So you coming at the angle. Go ahead, go ahead, finish. I probably can give it. The next fight will probably, probably make it to 12. And it'll probably, I still think Crawford going to whoop him. Because in order for him to come back and make this type of uh, adjustment, bro, you're going to have to fight yeah, a whole okay. different way. Yeah, yeah bro. Right, and right, I don't think right. you can make a whole different fight so style you, for you, bro. So the the thing when you say, as you saying, like, uh, boxing is uh, is not the same, you think you think that uh, promotion is promotion promotion companies are hiding the, the, the true skills of these fighters, like, I'm putting you in there with different type of fighters that fit your style, so you can look like you this uh, amazing ass person, and True. you really just you really just a regular degular, bro. I feel like that's just what it is, bro. And then mm-hmm. I, but before this fight happened, bro, I had kind of said that I kind of think that this fight was happening too quick. You know, this was gonna be, yeah, I did. You said no, nah, I just feel like that, bro. I just feel like mm-hmm. cut to the footage of him screaming at me. Nah, yeah. <laughs> Like, no, but I'm just saying, bro. Like, I just felt like whoever loses is gonna gonna drop down tragically, cause somebody was gonna have to get dusted, knocked out, 
some kind I of. I this is going to be a hard scrap. Good, but a good, you know, good, nice, hard fight. That, you know, it, it turned into some other shit. Like, mm-hmm. It turned into a punching. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I get it, but hey, whatever, man. I'm still going back and my boy was drugged up. Nah. We, we went behind the scenes. They they drugged him. Nah, he, he wasn't drugged. Yeah, yeah. He wasn't drugged. Like, he, it, it just underestimated somebody and then your trainer, like, being cocky. Like, he wasn't respecting the fight. I don't think it really it really wasn't too much Earl. It was too much cockiness on your side. It wasn't even you. You got people in the audience that was being more cocky than you. But he didn't land a punch. I didn't see that man land a punch, bro. I seen him land a punch. I watched that fight. Just like it just didn't affect me. 20 times already. I ain't see a punch get landed. That's I why I said this is like, bro, yeah. I can whoop him, bro. I'm back. <laughs> nah, look. Look, we didn't you know, we didn't even get to that. We gotta let this hurt go. Yeah, we gotta hopefully we be back and be somebody, you know, something else can show. Yeah, we gonna... Go we're gonna move we're gonna move on to the shit I, I want to come in with bro and I want to come in with is, is, is people even thoughtful anymore bro I want to come in like that and when I say I'm that nigga nigga there you go but I'm saying that because <laughs> it don't in this day and age it don't really seem like it's thoughtful shit going on it seems like it's all I gotta do is do some materialistic shit and I'm in like buy you a bag, buy you some shoes, and I'm in. Mean, or, uh, you know, buy the nigga some Balenciagas and get them the, the, the shit to go with it, and I'm in. Mean, is it even thoughtful shit anymore? Like, I was just thinking about you, so I sent you this. Or, uh, you know, like, I just bought you some random flowers, bro, because I was just thinking, they, I, you know, mm-hmm. damn, hey, hey, I'm in the store, man. I know you like Reese's Pieces. I just got them for you. You was a little musty, so I got you some deal. He got the best shit going on anymore, bro. Nah. Because it, it seems like more people be looking for, uh, I want the bag. I want this. I want that. I don't want thoughtful shit no more. Yeah. I, might think, I, think, I think, like, a lot of thoughtful shit go on but it, it, it go unnoticed because people be looking for shit to post mm. people looking for the mm. content so the small shit ain't about that it's more of the competition on the net yeah man, got this got like, this think part. about it like the flowers might be the only thing you'll probably yeah. still get the recognition but you they can post that just yeah, random flowers that, it's like i got flowers but yeah. i'm saying as far as like um other shit is more like Look at what baby got me a bag. You don't got one. Uh, think about Valentine's Day. They, that's a, it's a list of shit that, that you get. Birthdays, it's a list of shit. Thank you, babe. This, that, and the third. It's up right here. Mm-hmm. What the fuck are you thinking me on there tagging me for? Like, right here. What happened to just, hey, I thank you. Right, I love you. I yeah. appreciate it. No. Yeah. It's everybody looking for content or some shit to post to get that damn look what happened and, you, and, and that train was back down to a motherfucker looking at you like well you know he dropped the bone and dance mm-hmm. look look mm-hmm. man get yeah. that shit out of my face nah, i true. about that what you trying to say huh because what you trying to say it's all competition no, I'm saying, when well, you showing me what he did for her, what you trying to say? That's what you need to be doing. You need to step it up. That's what real men do. That's what she's saying. Yeah, real men blow say. bad. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Real men blow it out. So yeah. do you, would you, I, I, I want to ask this. Do you, have you, if you had a choice, would you rather go back to the thoughtful shit or you get baby the Chanel and she get you the Gucci's and just keep it like that? Nah, man, because whatever I do get I don't post it so it don't matter right. what the fuck it is like right. I'm cool with the with the thoughtful shit like me saying like man I'm you know what man I'm looking for me uh man I've been trying to find me some graphic tees mm-hmm. man I'm looking for some more graphic tees the ones they got man them other, mm-hmm. and all of a sudden I come home I got like four graphic tees that I don't give a damn them over seven dollars a piece yeah. right you went to uh, group 21 and found them and I'm oh, like yeah. you, I'm yeah. like man yeah, it's like when you say something. I do, cause I'll be, I'll throw out, man, my back hurt. If I wake up with that uh, 
The massage. The massage. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, 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 right. Or you hit me with the right, yeah. right, right. Yeah. The, 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 the smile shit surprised me. Like I could be sitting around looking like, man, I need to go in my head, man. I'm gonna go grab me a toothbrush. All of a sudden, I come on. How about you a toothbrush? What the fuck? I'm happy about that. Yeah, yeah that's like, Damn, it's like we connected somehow. You just already knew to grab mm-hmm. me. How you know I was thinking about that? That well, shit I had seen me. like the one that you was using. Yeah. You had looked at it a certain way and I was like, he must want another one. Yeah, mm-hmm. Shit mm-hmm. like that, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I seen that. I seen the bristles a little soft. Yeah. yeah. I got you seen my uh, cars falling out my wallet and you came with me, New Valentine. Right. Damn, bro. Yeah. yeah. You see like that, that print poking out my back. That, that wallet print was in every pass, <laughs> Yeah. See, that's what I'm saying. Shit like that. Like yeah. that. I'm good with that, bro. You ain't gonna lie to you. I'm good with the little shit. All that other shit, it, it really don't mean too much, like, because it's like, it's right, chipped up and watered down, man. <laughs> yeah, it's like cloudy. Everybody doing the same shit. I hate doing the same yeah, shit. Yeah, I don't you know, know what I'm saying? I'm not into that, bro. Like, I'm not, not impressed. Into, not at all. Like, yeah. I don't like females like that either, bro. They're just always trying to show you what somebody else's relationship doing bro like I ain't got shit to do keeping up with everybody relationship the jado mm-hmm. i hate that jado way though in the airy I, I don't like them type of females bro you yeah because you don't you don't never know the behind the scenes them laws not even fine to me yeah, I'm, I'm over there. It ain't even fine to me but like, i don't see the appeal of them like and i see these grown ass women be want to be like them i want to be a jada way to who rose you want to be one of these all these little young Hoes that eat wings and smoke hookah all day. Yeah, ain't got to twerk on every video. It's just a regular video walking. They got to turn around. I'm getting tired of all that shit, bro. Yeah, all that yeah, shit yeah, getting yeah. watered down to me. Out, bro. Yeah, like goddamn. That, that's that's that, uh, that's not what you were talking about. Well, we gonna get into yeah. we see. I'm glad you said it because I want to transition to the year of the thoughts, the year of the dirty hoes. Oh yeah, it's here. It's here. You are the dirty hoes, and when I'm saying that because yeah. Before we started, me and Ken was sitting there. The bathroom middle school always to be bad. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I want to get. Don't put me in there, bro. All right, you. I got this a Ken story, so I'm going to get first. I'm going to get first. Yeah. <laughs> Nigga, I said, don't put me in there. 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 Don't you know we all been knowing each other for quite a while. If you ain't know, I'm going to throw it out there. All of us been knowing each other since we was kids. These niggas got stories and of him pu- pushing them in the um in the, the, in the wagon. I got stories of Kim flushing me in the closet. But I, I was winning a lot of the fights. <laughs> <laughs> it's one time. But we was in middle school together. And you got to remember this. Wait, what happened? Kim had a little ratchet. It wasn't this woman or nothing. She had balled on the... She liked Kevin so bad, bro. Like, loved him. Oh. Why she for Valentine's Day bought some way grease in the brush? <laughs> he was happy. <laughs> nah, he was like, bro, this on steady behind me shit, bro. He had the first... He had the first trick I knew, bro, but she was... <laughs> she was a ratchet, She was bro. dirty, bro. Like, bro, bro. I don't know where she was getting it from. So come to find out, she, she was the first person that was doing scam. <laughs> she got the PPP before. <laughs> nah, but I, I, I just had to throw that out there, bro. But, but <laughs> I'm talking about the years uh, before the before the uh before we start recording. Like me and Kel was sitting back looking, and you know the Summer Walker video, Summer Walking, Suki and Suki, yeah, Sexy Red, yeah. And when I looked at that video, I said, man, it's the year of the dirty hoes. The dirty hoes is winning, bro. I know it's a nigga out there that they getting revenge on that he was, you know what I'm saying? Like, just fucking on and he yeah. wasn't even paying her no mind. Like, I'm just tearing the little up. Mm-hmm. Come through that 3 4 in the morning, didn't notice I want to be a rapper. Yeah. It was going to blow up. Yeah. Damn, mm-hmm. she feeling like some type of way. Like, yeah, nigga, look at me now type shit. I ain't trying to be no woman hater, but Summer Walker look dirty to me. She top. is, bro. She just look dirty, just saying dirty, that, bro. Yeah. I don't know about that. What's Smelly going box. on? Yeah, they bro. They wonder why she can't uh, keep the nigga and shit. Like, yeah, you know, like, I, I looked at that. When they went out, it was, I just looked at it like, oh, like, uh, mm-hmm. 
Smell it all in the camera, bro. Yeah, Sukiana look retarded, bro. One of them slow holes. Yeah, back then, everybody the fuck. Wash it up. Yeah, you know, one of them. <laughs> yeah, bro. Just one of them, bro. Like, man, that's uh, wild, bro. But it's the year of the, uh, the dirty holes, bro. So that's defeat. It's a lot of females out here. I know I'm not going to hate on them because I know there's a lot of females getting motivated. They get shitted on and, you know, they in Section 8 apartments right now. And niggas is coming, you know, when the, when the live hold in answer, they pulling up right there to uh, Aristocrats in Jailhouse and Wesley Square. Uh, that's and them. they tearing these little hoes up at 4.30 in the them, morning. Them five these, strike Adida, uh, oh. these are hoes that's coming up right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you feel me? Yeah. Them hoes right out them Section 8. Yeah, with about, with about yeah. you know three baby days. Yeah, you right, you right about You know, you know them hoes always got a son named Man Man. <laughs> the son husband. Yeah, yeah. Man Man. Okay. They little sixty year old son Tyrone. He locked up. Yeah, uh, King with yeah. the with the piece of King. King. <laughs> King. <laughs> you know they gonna have a son named King. Look at acting like he act, he think he my man. That doesn't <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Fuck you, bitch. That's some little young niggas already talking they crazy. They tell him, tell him. Yeah, she just laughing about nigga, the shit. Nigga, throw up your hood. Throw up your hood. That nigga come. Yeah. Throw up your hood. Get your ass off. What about Glorilla? What you think about her? Another one. Dusty feet. Dusty dirty. Yes. Working on them head like Nigga you know, all twerking on them whips, man. Come on. But I'm yeah, just saying. Twerking on them whips. Yeah. Yeah. Man, I would have. Man, like, get out of here, man. Get your, and then why you got your shoes off already? Shoes always off. This is what I was saying. That's why I like, say they used to be in bad for the bad. Yeah, it's the year of that, yeah. bro. Like, this is that year, bro. Like, it is, bro. I look, bro, you know it's sad when you're a regular nigga. I'm going to work every day, bro. Yeah. And I still be looking at these females. Like, I'm gonna I wouldn't even fuck that. Yeah, yeah man. Yeah, and that's bad. Because I know these motherfuckers getting that money they right they now. They don't look at it like, huh? How they got, man, look, bro, y'all see the shit, too. You know, damn, how much fun they look like they having, man. Look at that shit, bro. It's just like, really? Come on, you know, um, Krishan, she be having all the jury on, still missing a tooth. <laughs> Crack it. <laughs> bro, this is what I'm saying. Like, it's like, everywhere you look, it's that. Like, that's oh, what's up. Lizzo. Lizzo what? Dirty fat. <laughs> Lizzo, my nigga, mother love. Lizzo. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, I really don't know about Lizzo, bro. Lizzo I don't remember her. Oh, okay. Just but move damn high and power. But they all, I'm just saying, like, see, now we cracking. I don't gotta go. do all this. It, it be just the feeling, bro. Like, mm-hmm. it's alright if you gonna do your shit, kick pop your shit, because I know girls have fun different the way dudes have fun, but. Sometimes you look at it and you just frown up like, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. yeah, come on, bro. Like, we don't have fun up. like that, bro. I know, but I'm all saying, fun like, chilling. they fun be like, okay, I'm finna all get together. We finna twerk, shake our ass, laugh, and run off type shit. But what I'm saying is, you got that, right? With some girls having fun, throwing their ass, shaking their ass, pulling each other's dress down because one don't give a fuck. But then you got. The shit that just look dirty as fuck, bro. It's like Glorilla, sexy red. Yeah, the yeah, so What are y'all doing, bro? Like, like that. So okay. Looks yeah, good. but you, it, it, it's all in categories, though, bro. Like now that you said, this is how we able to know that they was Section Eight dirty hoes. Because what happens when we look at Meg? We, you say you work at Bombshell. You look like look. you work at Bombshell. Yeah. 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 Even though she could be, she could still be a little hood chick, but you can tell you can she's tell always some clean. Had her business together, niggas always want to fuck with her. But don't look when Meg says she worked at Bombshell, you can see it. Yeah, you can see it. She got that shape on. She do got that she got the right shape. I ain't know she worked there, but yeah. But what I'm saying is, it's just a difference between that barefooted, look, cheap, dirty looking dress, and it ain't even about how much she I'm just saying this combination together just don't go well. The, the weed that look like it still smell like the iron and shit like it's smell like, like black and mild. But what a coincidence that when she went through the shit with Meech or whatever and she went back outside, she just happened to run and come out with these two more dirty bitches. 
So yeah, they, they all even, cool. I ain't gonna even lie. This is some of the shit that the nigga was saying. Like, so <laughs> y'all just all, y'all all chill together. Yeah, they do. Yeah, y'all yeah. got some shit in common. But yeah, you already know yeah. the setup. You mad at the nigga and sign. Same setup. Yeah, same yeah. setup. Yeah. And then, so the then you know, did, you, did you ever see that to get that? Did you <laughs> did you go see your brother? There's a bunch of support. Yeah. Oh yeah, she looked so happy, girl. Do you live? Fuck that nigga. This, I'm this, ready to this, come this. out this summer, the summer way, the summer walk. See, that's why. I, yeah, yeah. That's why. Yeah. I'm, that's why I'm glad I got my girl, bro. Cause she came straight with it. She just came told me she. Man, I just did this bitch just said she had anxiety, social anxiety. Oh, now God. she out just somewhere smelling up the room. I bring you right. She is filling up the room. Nah, that okay, should be like pop outs, bro. But yeah. they use that shit and they make it, they make it rough for the, the females that really like, really do have them type of issues. Well, you, you know, Meach did the shit, so of course they finna bandwagon on this hoe and, and take us you, out. But what did you? What, 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 what he, he done? done? He, what did he do? He, he, he can't did. help this. He can't take a cousin the groceries in that bro. Yeah, I mean, you know. He was barely in there for a minute, but I ain't gonna lie. Niggas a minor, bro. <laughs> that shit pissed me off, bro, about it's no way you should be able to just sing your ring from next door. That's bad. Violate my pride. Like, bro. That's it, bro. Like, bro, that's it, come on, bro. She right got, or wrong, dog. She got paid for that, bro. That's just too, that's she too, that's too bad. bad. I'm of sure she yeah. did. You know she did, of course. I'm but sure. it's like, bro, that, 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 that's too much, bro. Nah, like, that was never sure. that she was still gonna put it out. Right. That's how thirsty motherfuckers are. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah. Right. Just to do that, some that, shit. That's just too much, though, for me, bro. It's like, are you serious, bro? Like, I'm, 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 I'm somewhere off the grid, and you, you you're supposed you? to be just walking in, in somebody's house, and then now I'm just exposed to walking in somebody's house? Yeah. That nigga Meech came on, they still had the uh, BMF face. <laughs> This yeah, that's, but uh, why these boys be coming to the age, bro? Tagging all little females, bro, like that. That's probably some he's been doing. Yeah, that was ridiculous, you know yeah, because he was too comfortable just sliding up and down. But he was in there for five minutes. That, that, what was mm. up with that? I mean, you probably shot him like yeah, but you gonna that. get the deal on the skin. I'm like, he probably <laughs> came in on that type of time. Like, I ain't gonna lie, I, 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 as I further look at the video. You did some investigation, did yeah. some research? I did some research. I did a little more research. <laughs> when I did, I got the research. Rico, you ain't fooling nobody. That was Rico? That was Rico. I knew it was Rico, bro. That was Rico. I seen a light scan. Nah, I'm bullshit. Yeah, <laughs> <bro. laughs> Rico Ross, I said it again. Yeah. Yeah. Two minutes. <laughs> but I, to the point that you said, because you before it slipped my mind. You said he was in there for five minutes. Yeah. But we we gotta we gotta we gotta sometimes we gotta let the jewels go, bro. And she, I just wanna let you fully dressed too in the same. Yeah. If I just you know what I'm saying? But let me let let me let this jewel let me let this jewel okay. go real fast, please. What these females gotta understand is all y'all ain't worth the fucking. The the leather knocked off for you. The, you know yeah. I tear the skin off your ass. Yeah. Some of y'all are just coming in and out. I just go in, get on out there. You know what I'm saying? It be like that sometimes, though. Five it's, minutes. Bro, even more than that, because I don't know if he did anything. Hey, hey, listen. I I, I, I'm not talking about him, because I really don't think he did nothing. He innocent. What I'm saying is, some of them, yeah, bro, it's like, they can walk around and be like, oh, that nigga, he, he don't fuck worth the shit. Bitch, I didn't fuck you worth the shit. You ain't worth getting your pussy beat up on and, and having some attachment to me. I don't even want to fuck again. I probably just was at that point where I was horny and drunk, probably. Yeah. Just I just yanked the big pants down, bent over. And all I did was hit you up or, or you, you, you bit on it, I'm finna fuck. Or we was somewhere, I already knew you, we got to chop it up, I came fuck. You think you finna really get some effort, dick? No, bitch. Mm-hmm. This is, this is so, you wanna I just want to put that work out in. Yeah, yeah. you crazy, bitch. Nah. What? Come on, bro. Every bitch ain't worth sticking around. Because you know what the what problems come with. I don't care what a female say. Once she get attacked, yeah, yeah, it's over. Don't play with me like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. for real. You can't so drop you that can't, you can't drop that dick on all of them. You got to 
You got the sideways fuck a, a bitch. Yeah, half with dick, that, half dick that, a bitch. Yeah, with that sideways, <laughs> yeah. Right, yeah. With that, with that, uh, with that mid dick, that pleasure yeah. one, that, that you gotta grab the back and put it. Yeah, yeah. You just stand there. Hold on, hold on, man. Yeah, yeah don't move. Yeah, you looking up in the sky, thinking about a whole another bitch. What you talking about? Bitch, you fuck out of here. Not real talk, bro. For real. Nah, no, seriously, no, bro. You, you right about that, bro. Yeah, I mean, but man, that's Meech, bro. He ain't supposed to cheat on that dirty bitch, man. I don't cheat on that. See, that's See. what. Nah, but we gotta. It's a dirty nah, I agree though, bro. How do the savages? I ain't, I ain't lying, bro. I agree because they had so they 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 had so much cop out bro, trying to make her like. And I'm a Summer Walker fan, Me bro. Too. I like her. I like her. Bro. And they got banged all the albums, bro. But y'all came out. She social anxiety, y'all. She don't like to be around people. But the whole time you was just ratchet, and they was just trying to cover it up. That's it. That's all it was. Cause soon as you was she hit the fan, yeah, yeah. As soon as she hit the fan, you went right back up there on the same bullshit. Yeah, I ain't see no social anxiety on that. The bitch on the car, scarred up after the incident, all type of shit. Just, yeah. Man, it is what it is, bro. Some wild shit. What? Um, but uh, what? You got? What you want? The next one? Yeah, I want to uh, talk about, it, bro. Um, just along the way, bro, you know, as you going up and up and up, bro, you know, I just feel like, I got to say it, bro, it's going to be some people that you run across that you might not want to use them to get where you're going, bro, but you might just have to use them for certain purposes, bro. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? It ain't, it ain't, it ain't a, uh. I want to say, bro, it, it ain't nothing personal, bro. Like, we're not doing this because we want to do it, bro, but it's just something that got to happen, bro. But well, Rocco has said business is business. Get personal when you're doing business. Get personal when you're doing business. Yeah. Get personal about that business. But yeah. I, I think that sometimes I think that's where uh, uh, relationships are made of. Not, right. not even just, uh, like, husband, wife, boyfriend, girlfriend type shit. I'm saying like relationships, period. That too. Though. Like, you, you use me for what you use me for and I use you for what I use you for. It's an even exchange. Right. Thanks. Not just one sided. Like, you milking me and I ain't getting shit out of the deal. Nah, that ain't how I'm saying, like, I might be using you for your knowledge and you might be using me for my resources. So this is how we work. Mm-hmm. I'm, yeah, it, it, right. It's an exchange of, 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 yeah. of shit. True. So, even like, you can have a female. That's what a fuck buddy is about. That's why I work so good. Yeah. I'm using you for dick. You using me for pussy. That's it. Man, and then there's all this uh, other shit. Don't even true. work on nothing. That's true. Even like a uh, boyfriend and girlfriend. Look, I'm doing the shit you don't do. Yeah. You do the shit I don't do. Yeah. And we gonna even out. Yeah. When it's one sided. And that's why a lot of motherfuckers don't that work with work people out. because it's they everything on them and what they get about of you. Yeah, that's like, why I, I always say like uh, every relationship that you have, you're gonna have to put the work in. So going to your point, when I say that, I mean like you just can't be lazy in any relationship you're in. You can't be lazy in your friendship in, with your girlfriend, with your mom, with whoever. You can't be lazy with them because. It's got to be a standard that you set for y'all relationship. Yeah, exactly. Because if you saying like, my standard going to be like, nigga, I'll take anything from you. You take anything from me. Our relationship bullshit. Yeah. But if I tell you, nigga, we here and we elevating yeah. and whatever we do, nigga, we coming here. So you expect that out of me each time that you come around me like, a nigga's going to be on some shit. So I got to be on some shit with him. Thanks. You know what I'm saying? It's the same with your female. So when you say that, it's like, I want to say this. It's like treat every relationship like it's business. You feel what I'm saying? You don't treat no relationship like it's business because we we at them ages where there ain't no more. We at the wreck just hooping. Yeah. Everything count now. So any relationship, nigga, if I can, if I ain't getting out of it, what I'm doing? Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm trying to get to. I'm like when you say even bar, it's the same shit, but like it's not purposely. I'm not purposely using you, but I have to use you for something, bro. You can't just be here. Where y'all is, bro? 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 Where y'all is, bro?
If, if you're not, if you're not the, I don't want to be around your time. Yeah. You waste some time. You're wasting time. Because if I'm just here, I'm not leaving. I, I'm not leaving. I'm not leaving better. Everybody supposed to leave better than with somebody. Mm-hmm. Like I don't give a fuck, nigga. If it's a conversation we had. I'm, I better be getting something out of the conversation. What the right. fuck are you calling me for? That's true. Don't call me for nothing. We might well, hello, hello, and then we just. I don't know the last yeah. time I called one of you niggas and said. Thirty <laughs> minutes, just alright, bye. bye. Yeah. I, ain't, I don't know the last time I called one of you niggas. Like, you seen the game last night? Yeah. What you got going, bro? Well, <laughs> everyone had fifty. Clear. <laughs> What's this nigga talking about? Yeah. Or oh, nigga, dude, what you got going, bro? This nigga, shit, you chilling. Yeah, I ain't got I'm shit. I'm chilling too, bro. Yeah, I'm on the phone like, what the fuck you got me for? You better it's be coming you. with something, bro. Nah, for real, what you want? Yeah. <laughs> for real. Just straight to it, bro. You got to call him. When you got to bitch, you got to call him. You're going to give me the skin. <laughs> get straight to business. I call him, bro. I'm getting straight to business. Yeah, bro, let me tell you what's up. Yeah, 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 these niggas, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. let me get ready because it's about to be interesting. <laughs> Nothing chilling, you know, uh, what? I'm, I'm driving for the hit and such and such. Oh. Oh, right. <laughs> Man, my phone I hate getting the text messages, bro. Like, a motherfucker hit you up and be like, what you doing? You be like, shit, I'm about to go run these there and probably drop off such and such, such. Then I'm going to go fuck with my daddy a little later. Oh. Bitch, what the fuck I supposed to do with that? Mm-hmm. I text you, you didn't text me back. Fuck am I supposed to take it back? Oh. <laughs> oh, okay. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. Thumbs up. Fuck on somewhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm a lot of What did I say to, oh? Oh, what? Oh, this conversation is done. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's yeah. fucking over with. Oh, yeah. Over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, it's the conversation over, motherfucker. That's what you talking about. <laughs> nah. But, yeah, I think that's the way it's supposed to work. And I think people just look at it wrong. Like, but it can't. The seesaw can't be like this. That motherfucker got to be like this. Yeah. Like, we both getting something out of it, and that's fine. Like, because sure. when it's like this, it's be like, oh, motherfucker, think, trying to use me. What the fuck you think this is? Mm-hmm. Yeah. You ain't got nothing to offer, but everything in the game, fuck you, nigga. You nigga don't like yeah. that. Yeah. Nah, that's facts. That's you know, facts. I got I got something I want to bring up to y'all, boy. Man. <laughs> I want to throw a fuck at now. <laughs> nah, but man, look. I want to discuss something, and I want to discuss every side of this. Tubi movies. <laughs> Tubi movies. I started off liking them. Matter of fact, I love Tubi as it is because it's free. Yeah. And fuck Netflix because Netflix is the guy on some bullshit. I don't, I got, I don't, I don't got Netflix no more. I, yeah, I'm on, that shit go. I still got Netflix, but I'm, I'm hanging on by a thread. I'm not going to even lie. I'm on my way. Fuck I, I'm on my yeah, way. Yeah, fuck it. Like, and then they ain't dropping that clone top on. That's about it. Yeah, Last thing I bought. Yeah, it was good. That was the newest shit. Yeah, I heard about that. Yeah, good. That's it. And uh, what's the name on that too, you know, Suits? I haven't started. Suits yet. good. Good, so good. They got that perverted nigga good. on there. You know that nigga that always a perverted in every movie. Yeah, you know exactly uh, what I'm talking about. That nigga that look like B.B. Herman. No, the black nigga. Oh, oh, I thought you were talking about. Uh, nah, no, it's the black, the black nigga with the gap. He always in every movie looking like a pervert. He was in Waiting Exhale. He the one that had. Uh, oh, you talking about uh, uh, nigga? Uh, you know my cousin, fat ass. Yeah, I know you talking about. Uh, uh, oh. <laughs> You know, yeah. you know exactly who you are. Yeah, I forgot that nigga. Name. But look, what, what I'm saying about the two movies, right? Started out by like them. I really be on that because they play a lot of the old classics and shit, right? Old classics be good. And then sometimes you can catch one of them old low budget ass movies that might be good, right? Mm-hmm. Cool. I see a lot of black. Actors and actresses that probably wouldn't have never got a shot in Hollywood. And they come on there and they doing their thing. Mm-hmm. You see a lot of them in the same movies and it's cool. Mm-hmm. Okay, now it's like, I done seen all of the drug dealing. I done seen all the stripping. I done seen the robbing, the killing, the scamming. I seen all this. And then I go back again. I seen all the drug dealing. I oh. seen all the killing, the robbing, the scamming, the stripping. Fine. And I could say them backwards. I've seen it. I'm like, okay, bro. All right. 
We it ain't nothing creative. We can't do nothing creative on that though. Change it. Like okay. nothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Same shit every time. They be acting like nobody don't make it out. Like, bro. Even Tyler Perry, he gonna come with the same script. Yeah. Thirty movies straight. Just but switching it around. Different messages. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it might be some type of message in that whole though, bro. Like, but it's always some scoring. That, some scoring shit going but, on. But you got to think, for him, though, I'm, that's his niche. That's just like, uh, uh, oh, what? They do the scary movies. That's mm-hmm. his niche. Oh, so okay. you find uh, your niche. Wes Craven. Nah, not true. him. Not Wes Craven, but something like Wes yeah, Craven. Yeah. yeah, like, all horror films, that's you. Right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Fine. That's what you do. Mm-hmm. Jordan Pierre, you do the, the weird shit. Yeah. That's you. Tyler Pierre, you do that shit. True, even though he even he even tried a couple of other things, yeah. but it be like a lot of them be a lot of them be, see that a lot of them be the same because then then the plays he came out with, Before. so he's just making them into movies. Movie, yeah. The plays were successful. Let's make them into movies. But that's his niche. Mm-hmm. What I'm saying about it is everybody doing a movie, but it's the same movie. Yeah. Yeah, I get what you're saying. Like, that's his niche. Fine. We know what to expect out of him. But when you click on Tubi, go to any one of them. Same thing. Drug dealing. I just feel like, uh, I feel like we ain't always got to make money off our stories. See what I'm saying? been told too many times. You know, that, our stories, that's that? Yeah, so well, let me explain. So when I'm saying it, I'm, I'm meaning like, they don't understand like it's other stores out there. Go get the white trailer track tra- uh, trailer park trash white family and do the story on that. Or go do some inbred shit. Go do the crazy rich Asians. Go go do Harwin. You doing this and that? Go do Harwin and seeing how they straight up. In the, you know, That's what I'm saying. Go ahead and spin it. Yeah, tell it the right way. Like do do something different, bro. Like. Four young niggas that grew up together all came up to be successful in their own way. Yeah, that's a cool ass story, bro. People want would want to hear. Yeah, it's not always like I'm trapping over here, these yeah. niggas trapping over there. Somebody got to be the king. We gonna kill him, this nigga. All yeah. right, bro. God damn, bro. Yeah. We get it's the rap game all over again. We get it, bro. Mm-hmm. We get it. Same story. We get it. And some of them be interesting, bro, and I'm the nigga that I'm be yeah, watching right. them. What's the nigga, shit, what's the nigga like, I like the nigga in Detroit? Oh, dude, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I like the nigga in Detroit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 yeah, but what I'm saying is, I'm taking it a, a step further, bro, is I'm saying, like, so many races make money off of us. Right. Why we can't, if two be like, why I can't go and produce a movie about Asians just, uh, wholesaling from us and they triple charging us. Right. Because we don't know the intricacies of what's going on with that. Like, right. man, the motherfuckers probably getting wiped out over there and we don't even know because right. I know it's some stepping on some toes. Right. Yeah. But while we can't, you know, talk about the trailer park track, the stepdad, you know, he fell in love with the daughter. Right. Mm-hmm. The daughter was 14. Right. Yeah. He raised her up and they kicked out the mama. Right. Yeah. Let's talk about that. Do yeah. something on that crooked white cop. Yes. Do his whole story. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, bro, you can you can get it, it's more stories in there, bro. Yeah, don't you love story coming with the daddy raping yes. the daughter and the stripper that had to grind her way yeah, up and fuck her way yeah. to the top. <laughs> yeah. bro, it's, it's other stories. Yes, yeah, we got more yeah. stories in there. It's a beautiful True. young woman that, that that had it rough and blossomed, was became a lawyer, you know, did out without none of that shit in between. But yeah. it's a good story because she might have uh they this guy he died it didn't mm-hmm. work out when it you can make a great story out of it. I know shit. a story bro that's so hard bro of a regular uh, a dude hey you need to calm down we finna make a two no 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 no, no. y'all don't know this dude <laughs> y'all don't know this dude bro <laughs> oh I thought you were saying that you you making the story up. no I'm making oh. the story but that's a cold story but y'all know him I know the nigga in the nigga the nigga end up getting his heart broke he ended up. <laughs> he ended up going to be a stripper and ended up a che- a teacher and was brought <laughs> off the <laughs> Y'all niggas don't know what I'm talking Man, about. Then he dropped out being fucking out of it. Say Hey that's a whole thing. Yeah. 
<laughs> like that. <laughs> you tip and turn teacher. Would you go watch it though? <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I go watch that story, bro. That's a hard ass story, bro. Fucking them college kids. Look at that He started going to college. Why this <laughs> nigga ended up being a successful teacher in. Right off into the sunset, but <laughs> we, what we gonna depict? Yeah, yeah, while I was doing. What we gonna depict is that time when he was a stripper. That's the point. That's gonna be one of the stories. Like it was throwing you right back to stripper. <laughs> <laughs> you go right back to stripping. Right back to stripping. Right. But they tell you the same thing. Hey, 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 they ain't taking the male side, bro. Oh, it was male strippers, bro. Nah, yeah. nah. All jokes aside, though. <laughs> Real talk, though. They, they don't. Y'all need to get out of They throw off into the <laughs> They don't talk about positive shit. They don't talk about. I'm, I'm being for real here, bro. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna do the and one story or some shit. That's hard. Come on. All jokes aside, bro. Like, I'm being real now. They don't talk yeah. about a story that we have, bro. Like. Some some niggas that was like didn't know, and then we had Brandon Mama to you know as a person that leaned on in our life. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? They can do a story on that. Like man, it was one lady that got us all straight. Like we we all came up and, and nobody yeah. believed in us. Yeah. And we all became to be something. Wasn't no drugs or no we would love drugs. A little bit. Put a little bit in there. there. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's the story. It's positive. Yeah. They be so focused on the negative and let's stay on the negative. Know, y'all nigga whip this story up to make her look like we was a positive little bit. <laughs> <laughs> Tell the truth, man. Bro, I'm like, we gonna we gonna put the truth. We gonna you gotta put some truth in it. But no shit. It's killed. Snow the white girl on <laughs> <laughs> They killed this some of the most old shit. I'm yeah. talking about that. Where's it going on? Nah, but uh, where it going on? Nah, but straight up though, bro. I, I just don't get me wrong, nigga. I, I like some of the movies and shit, but I, I got to watching that shit the other day. I was looking for something. I'm like, every time I see Erica Miller, next, <laughs> I'm going to She and all of them. She and all of them, bro. Love that. She's running the back. Yeah, she, oh. she good. She got all right, though. Little mama, little mama be doing her thing. For real? Right? Like, she and some of the fuck, but I'm saying she can kind of act, though. Yeah. She can kind of act. I'm like, okay, I can focus on that shit. They got some good series and shit on that. They got some good shit, but I'm saying it's more to us than that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I see. Where, I see where you're coming from, bro. It's more to us than that, bro. We we created. Mm-hmm. Somebody yeah. just do something about something else. Facts. I think we need to go and make a movie. How, How much you need to make? Yeah, a movie? but for real, I no, you, you make your own movie. Make your own movie. Then you put it okay. together. Yeah. I mean, it can't be hard. As we look at they that. pick it up. They gonna. I know they're gonna pick it up. Cause I seen some shit on there. Man, that was like no. I seen no, one with that dude behind that tree. He just shot. You yeah, seen that shit, bro, <laughs> bro? But this, this the shit I want to talk about, bro. Because I, I was thinking about this shit, bro. Like a lot of, a lot of people, uh, childhood and how they brought up. They'll think that shit is like right in how you supposed to do everything, raise your kids and how it's supposed to be. Cause I was just saying to myself, I was like, uh, man, you know what, bro? I'm a, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm not gonna go and do everything and be at the kids game and rah 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 and do all this. I'm gonna take care of my kid rightfully so, but then I'm gonna go do something for myself. You know what I'm saying? But you know, a lot of people are poor all that shit and that. Then the kid grow up and don't see you two times a year. So what I was saying is, is a lot of people be thinking like the way they grew up and their structure of how they grow up, that's the way it's supposed to be passed on for generations. It don't work like that. You would think like just because a mother, okay, prime example, you couldn't get up before you left the table before you finished eating your food. Mm-hmm. I'm not doing my kid like that, bro. And you gonna sit there and eat it? You shouldn't. You you ain't want. I'm not doing my kid like that. my kid don't want that shit. Don't eat it. What you want? It's because you got the bread to do that. I get what you're saying. Evolve. Evolve. I'm finna throw that fork in there. <laughs> yeah. I'm finna put that fork in there. Because the money. Mm-hmm. Money plus the, the whole, whole reason why you had to eat it because ain't nobody had no money to waste. Mm-hmm. Nigga. You gonna eat that money for the food. Yeah. But if you think about it now, and I also remember in my, in my time growing up, 
it was Google food stamps going around. So it was food stamps, nigga. You had you can go get the food. Yeah, but still, yeah, but my mama used to be like, "What cereal you want?" Come, okay, come but look, but look, Ken, it's been months too where something happened and that motherfucker don't come. Nah, that's true. So yeah. it may have counted, bro. Yeah. Everyone, but we knew that then when it counted. We knew that we had to eat this shit. It wasn't no choice. But you, you had your same go tos when it was time to eat the noodles, sandwiches. So shit you still like to this day. I still go eat a noodles here. To okay, here. but look, that's like that's like when you had you, you you ever been like you know you young you been caked up and then it, it, all of a sudden you don't know where that bread went you was broke. Every you gonna think about where the fuck that money went. Mm-hmm. That's what I'm saying by why it's like you gonna eat the food. Nah, when I say that, <laughs> that's true. When I say eat the food, I'm not talking about how you saying like it was it's a, a broke thing or I'm talking about it's a thing. Nah, I know what you're saying. When you got black eyed peas on a plate and the kid don't eat black eyed peas. I had to stay at the table for the you know black eyed peas. Yeah, 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 you gotta eat that. That's what I know, man. I like peas. Yeah. yeah. If my kids like peas, peas, I'm not gonna make you eat no peas, brother. You're not gonna even serve it a peas. Yeah, bro. you don't even want the you know shit. Yeah. Like, yeah. But you know, back then when it was just like, this what I made, this what you gonna eat. Yeah. Nigga, nowadays, nigga, we so evolved and having things and stuff like that. It's like, man, we got five hey, different quarters. Yeah. What y'all yeah, gonna eat? Yeah. We gonna eat this. Yeah, this yeah. Home, I'm on the door, Dad. Right, yeah. right. What you yeah. say you want? Hey, right. I ain't finna do nothing. I'm not doing none of that. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna make this or whatever. We eating this or uh, whatever. You know how kids be picking up you like leftovers. Yeah. We gonna eat them leftovers. What yeah. y'all gonna get? All right, bet. I didn't thought about that shit. I remember times when I didn't, we didn't had two baskets full of groceries. It's going down, and then it's sometimes I'm like, damn, I'm eating uh. Toast and, and, and cinnamon on <laughs> sandwich. I'm gonna, Dude, there's yeah, Kaji, bro. There's so many, yeah. bro. I thought was empty. Damn. I think I was eating with all the rum. You were starting to eat it all when he threw them corn dogs away. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Because I was going down, bro, and I whip with one of my specialties. I'm whipping it up. I'm like, man, I done made my cold What's pasta. What's the Pasta. Oh, okay. I done made my cold of uh, the burritos. The burritos. <laughs> you know, you cook the burritos. <laughs> you know, hold up. 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 The game, bro, put the hot dog in there, man. This ain't the burrito from last week. This is different because it's chilling. It's a Chipotle burrito. Nah, that's what he is. Hey. He bro, talking bro, about bro. this is back when I had like about four meals. Now, you know, I'm he still know. was, he still was, like, he was good, but it was about four. Got- whipping up, bro. Yeah. I thought looking at the day, I'm. He's Tuesday, Tuesday. Burrito day is a burrito day. Right, I, I seen them down one day before I got off. Yeah, all right. It's burrito day, bro. That's what I want. <laughs> Nigga, I saved my stomach. I've been telling you, I've been all day for this burrito. Hey, chill, now, which bro. one is this, bro? That nigga, yeah, it's that one. <laughs> we were getting a special. Nah, but she, she'll, she'll come, bro. I done whipped the burritos, bro. She'll come and look and I want pancakes. I'm like, bro, so you just not going to... Nah, I want pancakes. That's how Sierra is. Yeah. You put that burrito on the pan? Nah, no, I'm not eating it, bro. I want pancakes. In the morning? <laughs> it's in the morning, right? At night. Oh, shit. Yeah, yeah my son. Like Nigga, my fucking kids eating cereal at night time. Come on, bro. Give me. No, that's, 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 that's basically what you're saying. So you saying, like, if you cook a meal and your kid don't want that meal, you're going to get him something else. Yeah. A whole other meal. Yeah. Or you gonna take your ass and then cook some, eat some noodles? Yeah. Or because yeah. they usually eat frozen shit anyway. Yeah. Put a piece in there. Yeah. Or yeah. Some shit. yeah so oh, okay. They they simple, bro. They, they don't. Okay. Eat. That's what I'm saying. The times have changed. Like you ain't gotta you ain't gotta subscribe to that trauma no more. Yeah. Yeah. You ain't gotta subscribe to that trauma. How yeah, that, that's that what I was saying, saying too. Like not saying that I, I was just saying that not what whatever they did wasn't wrong. It was just to what they was available to. What I'm saying is like they 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 wouldn't waste. We would just be like, you don't want to fucking throw that shit away. Yeah, it mm-hmm. is what it is. You know what I'm saying? But in me, I still got that in me. Don't get me wrong, though. I don't give a fuck about none of that shit. But I still be sometimes be more like, damn, I don't want to waste this shit. 
I ain't going buy no another meal though. Nah, nah. No. I can tell you that right now. If you think you're not gonna eat this, I want some Chick Fil A. Nah, we man, you better. Hell no, I'm not going to spend small. Yeah, I don't know what you're thinking. No, I'm not going. That's stupid ass shit. You can eat whatever you want. Did y'all have to get up out the? You know, you couldn't get up. You couldn't drink nothing until you ate. Yeah, I see all that shit like that. Like I'm not doing it. That big ass jug of. Oh, we had that big ATB juice. Yeah, I don't think. Nah, I can, we can oh, pull the juice with that Thin yeah. ass juice. <laughs> you were thin as a motherfucker. I missed this juice. I was down in that juice like yeah, it was the best shit ever. It used to be my favorite shit. But nah, I, I, I never had to go through that. I was telling my daughter that bullshit about, uh, about, uh, like I had her watching cartoons with me and she got hot. What you had? Watch, we were just watching Tom and Jerry. And she got mad because it ain't no words. She got hot. She's like, this is dumb. <laughs> I'm like, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> yeah, fuck you mean? This is good. I'm not 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 good. What's that? Well, they ain't got that. They watch it. Wake up and watch a cartoon. They YouTube you, gonna start off off the roof. In the morning? My kid eat pancakes and waffles. Cause it, my kid eat pancakes. Yeah, same thing. Yeah, you got to make a full thing. But the thing about it is, nigga, them, them cereal ain't the same. Them cinnamon toast crunch ain't the one it's for that. I don't really eat cereal like that no more. I don't eat cereal at all, bro. Yeah. I, I, might eat some cinnamon, I might eat some cinnamon toast crunch here and there. I couldn't That's eat about it. Milk, bro. Anything I do got to be on hey, the toilet. You're going to be in the, on the toilet, you do that shit. I got it. Yeah. If I'm eating a bowl of cereal, it's why I'm on the toilet. Because as soon as I take a bite, <laughs> that bitch runs straight down through, bro. Like, I'm, I can't do that shit no more. Yeah, bro. I hardly can eat nah, cereal. Nah, I, I really don't eat it. I can't eat a lot of snacks like that. Me either. Sweets, none of that shit. Yeah. That shit hard to eat. Plus, you know what it about it, nigga, just stop blowing. I need that weed, man. Yeah. Give me mm-hmm. one blunt, nigga, and I'll tell oh, the you corner tell store down. Yeah, yeah, boy. Give me the Just baby cookies, baby everything. Stale yeah. candy from them uh, mm-hmm. Asians and everything. Yeah. From Pac store. Yeah, all that. Yeah. Right, come on. <laughs> oh, yeah. Hey, <laughs> but for real. I used to do that shit. Nigga, come on, man. Come on, man. man, bro. That's the one that got killed in there. Yeah, yeah, I think so, yeah. yeah. That was my boy though. He, he never, too. he never played with me. Me like too. That. He just used to say shit. He used to always do that, yeah. 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 But the funny thing about it was, you know the part that killed me about that? They kept his blood on the cigarettes uh, for a long time. Right. Because this nigga had blew his brains out in that bitch. And that nigga blood was on that, on the C8 man's DJ. And then we should go in there. They were still selling the cigarettes? Yeah. What you want to do, trash? No, why not wipe that shit down? Oh, I thought you would just okay. I thought the blood was stains just... were still on there. They packs had got creaking uh-huh. in the motherfucker after that. Yeah, y'all gonna see what packs is in a minute. Cause we got some shit going though, but we ain't gonna we ain't gonna display it. Yeah, it was hard. Mm. But I know that that nigga there, bro, he was a legend, bro. Cause it'd be many a time, like how you said. The times when, when when we ain't really have shit, you can go down and get credit. I swear to God, yeah. I was just about to talk about That's that. That's how you know you, you really. I was just about to talk about that. Hood, that you get credit at the store. I was just talking about that. Yeah. Till I get paid, I'm bro. Man, I need a sandwich. Man, go ahead, man. That nigga write that shit down. I come back all day. Come with a twenty, I'm on, bro. What's up? What's up? What's up? You got your tab? Like a dog. Yeah. Y'all going there get like a little Yeah. I used to do it just to stunt, like, hey, I got, I got a tab over here, yeah, yeah. Right. and we just walk out. You just get to leave with all that stuff? Yeah, you know who I am? Yeah. Right. yeah. yeah. Nah, facts, bro. Yeah. Not knowing who the poor. <laughs> I grew up with this nigga, man. This nigga like my uncle. <laughs> that, that's another thing, like, it, like I, if a, if a person asks me, we can we can close it out with this, but I just want to end it with this. When a person asks me where I'm from, I usually don't say where I'm from, bro. I just be like, you know, I'm from Houston. But I never forget where I come from. Like, I ain't gotta tell you all whenever because I'm not like. It's also about growth. It's also like, nigga, I didn't grow up from that shit. That from me just being say I'm from the Southwest, I'm claiming the hood. Like I'm not claiming no hood, bro. Like. Uh-huh. 
Yeah. But nigga, I know where I come from. I know, I know my hood and our hood, bro. Is it, 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 it bred some of the most go getting ass niggas, bro? Fact. That's not on no dumb shit. So when I'm saying that, it's also like an oxymoron of me saying that, cause nigga, I'm saying that because the, the hood stand on it. The hood will tell you I'm not from the hood. Right. Because, nigga, I'm trying to go get paper. Because yeah, we boy, it was bread of hustlers, bro. Yeah. It wasn't bread of no. Yeah. I'm from the West. I'm gang. I'm blood. I'm I'm, I'm crib. Yeah. Nah, I was, nigga, we bought paper over here. Yeah, facts. Hustling niggas. Man. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Yeah. Anyway, that's yeah. a fact, bro. Those would be surprised if you blow up and you see some dirty niggas from out there. Just, man, them niggas ain't really a G drive. Hey, you can say what you want to say, bro. <laughs> it is what it is. Nigga, we, I'm yeah. just saying, bro. You know you probably have them niggas don't show this. Yeah. I ain't and seen that nigga. We like that. It is, bro. I can't even respect you if a nigga don't say, I ain't never seen that nigga in the hood. Nigga, what I supposed to be doing in the hood? Yeah. Facts. When I was out there, nigga, you was a kid, nigga. I, it yeah. was treacherous when I was out there. Yeah, facts. You little dirt bag. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the most dangerous part was closed down. When I was over there, so. Man, facts. Yeah. Nigga, we did that damage to make it sweet for you over there. Yeah, niggas that no, no. Facts. Mm-hmm. But you know, hey, it's episode 38, man. Is it? We talk episode 38. It's a special drop for y'all, too. Late night edition. We out. That's another one. Like my boy say. Like, comment, and subscribe, man. As always. I you said you didn't care about that. Yeah, I really don't, but yeah. He back to care. Yeah, go ahead, man. He care a little bit. Y'all do what y'all do. <laughs> All right. Hey, if y'all run a, if y'all run a, uh, let's say y'all run a, the likes up to like 20, he'll start carrying 20 <laughs> <laughs>